I'm pretty confident you remember this, 105 degrees in July of 2012 on two occasions, one degree shy of the all-time high temperature in Indianapolis. It was set up by an incredibly dry June and July. During that stretch, we would typically have over nine inches of rain. We just had around an inch. Nine days, 100 or hotter, 51 days in total of 90 degree temperatures or hotter. As far as our summer this year, we had a lot of rain through mid-July and then it shut off. We've only had 3,600 so far this month. That's setting up our recent wave of heat. On average, we have 20 days of 90 degree temperatures or more. We're up to 12 so far this summer with several more straight ahead. The all-time record for 90 degree days in a year, 1983. So we're hot, but not really.